Sixth grade, module one, lesson 18, problem set. Number one, N Gunn earned $17 per hour tutoring student athletes at Brooklyn University. A, if N Gunn tutored for 12 hours this month, how much money did she earn this month? So she earns she earns $17 per hour and she tutored for 12 hours this month. So let's do 17 times 12. 2 times 7 is 14, carry the 1. 2 times 1 is 2, plus 1 is 3. Done with the 2, put our 0 down. 1 times 7 is 7, and 1 times 1 is 1. If we add those together, we get $204. So she made $204 this month. And then B, if Engun tutored 19 and a half hours last month, how much money did she earn last month? So let's do 17 hours times nine, or 17 dollars times 19 and a half hours. And we did learn how to multiply decimals in fifth grade, so let's go ahead and do that. So 7 times 5 is 35, put my 5 down, carry the 3, 9 times 7 is 63, plus 3 is 66, 7 times 1 is 7, plus 6 is 13. Now erase what I carried, done with the 7, on to the 1, I'll put my 0 down, 1 times 5 is 5, 1 times 9 is 9, 1 times 1 is 1, I'll add them together. And I get 3,315, but remember we had a decimal point here. And the number of digits that are behind the decimal point, and in this case it's just one, there's a five, we're gonna move the decimal point. So it starts here, I'm gonna move it one place over. So we actually get 331 dollars. Try that again. 331 dollars and 50 cents last month. Number two, the Piney Creek Swim Club is preparing for the opening day of the summer season. The pool holds 22,410 gallons of water and water is being pumped in at 540 gallons per hour. The swim club has its first practice in 42 hours. Will the pool be full in time? Explain your answer. The pool holds 22,410 gallons. It's being pumped in at 540 gallons per hour and they have 42 hours to do that. So we want to see if they're doing 540 gallons per hour for 42 hours, if that's going to be enough to make it to 22,410 gallons. Let's multiply 540 gallons times the 42 hours and see if we can get enough water. Two times zero is zero, two times four is eight, and two times five is 10. Done with the two, onto the four, put our placeholder there. Four times zero is zero, four times four is 16, carry the one. Four times five is 20, plus one is 21. Add it all together. So we'll get 22,680 gallons after 42 hours. And how much did we need? We needed 22,410. So yes, there will be um, there will be enough water to fill the pool in time. because we need 22,410 gallons and after 42 hours 
we would have 22,680 gallons.